as these drivers get set to go. Just a couple minutes away from the call to fire, starting... The NTT data car in the NTT IndyCar series has a first poll. How did you get this done? Well, yeah, I think we've been up there all day. You know, the, the NTT Honda car has been amazing. You know, big thanks to the, all the 10-car crew and also the 9-car crew. Uh, yeah, just really good day. You know, started very solid. Uh, been sort of top five all day. Uh, and that's final run on reds. You know, in the first two laps, I didn't really feel like I had a grip. And then the final lap, there was just something switching on. And I was like, okay, this is... This could be good, but honestly, I didn't think it was it was going to be it. It's so tight, and uh, yeah, looked at the screen, and we're P1, and uh, you just pray it's going to going to hold to the end. But uh, yeah, fantastic! Big thanks to my team. Third time in the Firestone Fast Six. First time on the pole in Turn One, as I'm sure you've seen from video, is pretty hairy here. What kind of an advantage is it? Not only to start up front and then have your teammate next to you tomorrow. Well, at least you don't have anyone behind to worry about, so that's always a pro. Uh, you know, I spent the last two races sort of in the in the angry mid pack, so it's a, it's a good change to to be back where we were in uh, St. Pete and Coda. Uh, yeah, also well done by Scott. You know, uh, I hope we can sort of go together to the to the finish in uh, one two there. When you analyze your lap around here, where could you have found two one hundredths of a second? I think I think if you ask any driver, there's loads of places you can find two hundredths. <laughs> like it's yeah. not much time. But uh, firstly, a huge congrats to Felix. He's a he's a uh, hell of a talent, and it's cool to team up with him and, and to see him get his pole so early, uh, his first pole so early in, in uh, his IndyCar career. But yeah, it was. Uh, First lap, I probably didn't go hard enough. Then we kind of did a cool down lap and then went again. Second lap, I kind of went off track and two a little bit, yeah. uh, which would have been all the difference. But, you know, I'd, Felix probably had similar scenarios too. But uh, the good thing is cars are very similar. They've been quick all weekend. You know, uh, for us, it's been a great start to the year with, I think we've been in the fire, Firestone, Firestone Fast 6 yeah. every race. So that's uh, it's good to see, but we'll see what uh, tomorrow brings for Chip Ganassi Racing. How big was that? Well, I feel like we've been on the brink of having this kind of result for a little while now, and 
you know, I think the pieces have started to come together really well and we tested well last week, so I think we came into the weekend optimistic. But I mean, bear in mind, you know, our, we're still a part-time team. You know, we're doing more races, but I think we're showing everybody that we can get the good results. Uh, obviously, we're going to try and deliver a good race for everybody tomorrow, for everybody at Alternation, everyone at Sirius XM. But, you know, bear in mind, the season goals are to qualify in the top. 12 so to qualify third today you know and be so close to nearly being on pole obviously congratulations to uh, everybody at chip ganassi racing they locked out the front row and i know how good felix is from uh, you know when we've competed together in the past so uh, honestly it's just nice to be that far up the grid hopefully we have a, a clean race tomorrow and finish where we start or maybe a little bit better would be nice the difference in the Firestone Fast 6? Um, you know, I think the car was good. I just think we, we just chose the wrong strategy. You know, I wanted to go out for one and one. Um, so so one, on, one time lap on one set of reds, another time lap on another. Uh, but it seemed like the better way was, was to go out and do two, ti two time laps on one set of reds. Um, if that was the difference, I don't know. The Ganassi cars were very strong. Felix did a very good job. Um, so it, it was you know, I don't want to say it's going to be an uphill battle, but uh, they, they look very strong for the race. So uh, we'll go go and do our homework, um, and I think the, the guest green car will be really fast tomorrow. We look good on all tires.